Hello everybody and welcome to the channel, it's Paul Yester here, and today we're going to listen to the voice of Sable Ward. Sable is the new survivor coming out in the upcoming Dead by Daylight chapter, All Things Wicked, and so we got to test her in the public test build before the chapter's release uh, around March the 12th, and the data miners were able to pluck all of the audio out of the files that are connected to Sable, and they organized all of her voice lines. There's 40 in all. Some of them will be ones that she says when she enters a lobby. Some of them will just be her idle thoughts as you're like spending on the blood web or purchasing outfits for her, etc. Um, I think there's 10 when she enters the lobby and 30 idle sounds. Now, a lot of these are repeats. What happens oftentimes is they'll do multiple takes and they'll put them all in the files and then they'll choose whichever one they like best to go live with. So while there are 40 sounds here, not all of these are going to be in the game and you'll hear a lot of similar or repetitive uh, ideas that she speaks about here. It's a lot like what we saw with Nicolas Cage. All right, so we're just going to go ahead and start down the line of 40 and we'll listen to all of them together. Great. Not again. I get the feeling something bad is about to happen. Yum. I get the feeling something horrible is about to happen. See the similarity between those two? This all feels very... familiar. Super. Yum. Sable, to be fair, you just got here and you seem like you're over it already, okay? <laughs> <laughs> you were the one who was like, I don't want to let my friend Michaela have all the fun. And then you're like, great, we're at the campfire again. You know, be careful what you, f what you wish for. You know what I'm saying? All right. Where am I? Where's Toto? Fantastic. A fire. Yeah. We're so lucky. A fire. Yum. Bring out the marshmallows. A fire. Yum. Whatever we do, separating isn't the best idea. Who forgot the marshmallows? <laughs> the nerve. She's really obsessed with marshmallows. Either she really likes marshmallows or this is a clue that we're getting the Ghostbusters chapter with the uh, Stay Puff Marshmallow Man. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, people. Let's try to work as a team. Okay, this is not what I expected. A fire. Wow, we're so lucky. <laughs> Does anyone know where we are? This ain't Kansas, is it? I feel like Dorothy, except no dog and no flying house. So the moral of the story is, doesn't matter. So the moral of the story is, stay away from the fog. That's a good one. I like that. So the moral of the story is, you see fog, you run away. <laughs> Even better. Even better. So the moral of the story is, we're screwed. So the moral of the story is, death isn't what I expected. This feels like something I read. Huh. It's like I'm in a story I heard at the Moonstone. Anyone else feel like they're being watched? I have the feeling I've been here before. I just had a deja vu. Yum. I just had a deja vu. I think I know what's going to happen next. I just had a deja vu of you talking about your deja vu. I haven't enjoyed a moment like this since I had my wisdom teeth pulled. <laughs> yeah. Let's hear a campfire story. Someone bring a radio? A 
I want to hear a creepy story. She is protected by the power of good, and that is greater than the power of evil, I hope. If we walk far enough, we shall sometime come to someplace. Okay, I want to wake up now. Seriously. Anyone have a story they want to share? Anyone have a ham? I know a great station for scary stories. Ham Radio. She's an old soul, huh? I've seen a lot of people complain that they feel like her voice is too old sounding. I don't know. I mean, I, I think it's fine. It works for me. I like that raspy, husky tone to her voice, and I love her sassy attitude. Uh, it really fits her lore. Uh, I'm really digging it. Anyway, those are all of the files there. That's all 40 of them. Uh, as I said, you can see there are a lot of repeats and not everything is going to make it into the game. Probably half that or maybe less than half of that in a totality. But that's all of the sound, the dialogue, I should say. She has many more sound files with all of her grunts and screams and things like that. But that's all of her dialogue lines that are in here. And some people said, well, will they go back and retroactively add voice lines for other survivors? I don't know if they will. I kind of would like it on some level as far as Sable having that friendship relationship with um, Michaela. It would be nice if how Renato and Thalita acknowledge each other when they're in the lobby together. But we don't see any of that here right now. So it doesn't look like it's something that's going to be done soon. Um, if there were obviously some lines where she was acknowledging Michaela that would be triggered once they're in the lobby together, then I would say, well, maybe they're going to go back and give at least Michaela some voice lines so they can talk to one another. But we don't have any indication of that right now. But I do think that would be a cool thing. What do you think? What do you think about Sable's voice? What do you think about the survivors talking as much as they do in recent times um do you like that I, I personally like that feature how do you feel about talking survivors now uh i don't believe she has any voice lines uh does she have voice lines in game i can't remember from the ptb now if she loads in if she speaks the way nicholas cage delivers a line i can't remember now hmm i'll have to go in the ptb and check myself i guess load up a game and see what happens all right, but that's all I have for you today. Let me know what you think about all of this. As always, thank you so much for the time that you spend here with me on my channel. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe as it helps the channel a ton. Don't forget to take care of each other in and out of the fog. And we'll see you next time. Have a great day, everybody. Bye-bye. It's a Gen Rush life for us. It's a Gen Rush life for us. Set a hiding, we do gens. Set a randoms, we got friends. It's a Gen Rush life.